Hey guys, what's up? It's Mac Knowledge HD here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can clean your MacBook Pro. Now, basically, what I'm going to be showing you guys is how you can clean your screen, your keyboard, and everything that has to do with it. Okay, so this is basically what we're going to be using. This is something uh, you can you can clean screens with. Basically, it tells that it's um, it works on the iPhone, and basically, the iPhone screen is basically just like a MacBook Pro screen, and also works with PC and um, you know TV, plasma TV, and LCD and everything like that. Okay. Um, we're also going to be using this type of soft um, cloth. Okay. This I think this comes with your MacBook Pro to actually uh, clean the screen, and also we're going to be using water. Okay. So get some water and also this type of stuff I like using it if you don't want to use it just don't this is not uh, this is optional okay and yeah and don't get anything that that you use to clean your uh, your windows okay not windows as PC okay your windows in your house okay don't use anything like that okay so let's get right into the video alright guys so we're all set up and ready to go make sure you put a towel right there and your MacBook Pro on top of it in case um, something uh, you know falls off there and well, anything like you know what I mean okay so what you're gonna get is this type of stuff it's really soft it won't harm your computer okay and it might be weird to see me with this but anyways I always work with those if I'm cleaning so um, yeah let's start okay so you're gonna get this which is a uh, basically a spray thingy with water okay and you're gonna put it on this okay not that much because you don't want your MacBook Pro to get wet so well, yeah, you want to make it wet, but not that much, okay? So you're going to go here and start doing that. You see, it basically clears up the MacBook Pro. But that always happens if you put water on it. So, yeah, just go ahead and do that over the whole thing. The Apple logo. All right. And another time, okay? Let's go back. All right. All right, guys. And you might be thinking it looks weird now because you know all those things when the water goes up, it's it looks like uh, it's damaged, okay? But but you know what I mean, okay? So what you're basically gonna do, you're gonna turn the thing around and go over it again to make it dry, okay? With the dry part. Okay, it looks like it's uh, it's basically gone through it, so it's both parts wet. So I'm gonna try and actually find a part that's not wet. All right, this looks like it's not wet. And yeah, basically that's all you have to do for the front part. Actually, um, now let's move on to this ones, to this parts right here. Okay, so uh, basically. I'm gonna try to get this on camera, okay? Um, those parts, okay? You just wanna go over those and never go over these things, okay? Never go over the holes or anything like that. So just go over this and maybe on the other side as well. Okay, spin it around, wait for it. Okay, and there are a lot of holes here, so you don't you don't wanna go over those, okay? So just get a dry part, dry part, okay, not wet part, and just go over those a few times, maybe a bit in there to actually clean whatever it's in there, you know. Okay, back part. I guess I have a little scratch there, but you know, my MacBook Pro is like, uh, I don't know, two or three years old or four, I don't know. So, yeah. Um, just go over this part. Okay. Dry. Okay. And just the other part right here. Let's go over that as well. Get in there, hopefully clean it a bit. It's actually hard to get in there while I'm recording this. 
All right. All right. Well, that's basically what you have to do to actually from the top part, okay? And actually, we're gonna try and spin this around quickly and go over this part. You can make this part wet as well, not as much, okay? Just a little bit. And that's it. Basically, just take the dry part, make it dry. <laughs> By the way guys, the things that don't clean are scratches, so don't try to clean those up because it won't work, okay? So, great. Now we're all done with this part, so let's move on to the end part. Alright guys, so we're going to continue with the end part of the MacBook Pro, and we're going to go on with the keyboard, okay? So as you can see, I have an Apple sticker right there. And yeah, so you're going to, for this part of the um, cleaning section, you're going to take this, okay? And just go over this a few times. Okay, and again, make sure your MacBook Pro is off before you do any cleaning. Okay, doesn't matter if it's on the in part or the out part. Okay, just go over it a few times. Well, and as you can see, I don't know if you can see with the camera, but you know, it's also some dirty stuff in there so I, I can't really get access to that but you know I'll try it later so what you're gonna do now is actually take spray again and put a little bit okay really not that much okay just maybe one and then actually take some off you know there it's too much so actually just wipe it off I don't know if it's cold I don't know if it's cold to wipe it off but you know what I mean okay so yeah so that you can't see any water um, drops or anything like that just that it's wet but there is nothing on it because you don't want anything to go inside the keyboard because as many of you know uh, you can take those off and you don't want anything to go in there so yeah just go on and clear every single um, thing there all right Okay. It's really easy guys. It's it's really not that hard. If you see that you're run out of water and it's not that much anymore then just go ahead and put on some more wipe it off and continue okay so really not that hard guys because you know from typing it might have like uh, fingerprints and everything like that so you don't want that it makes you your computer look dirty and it's always good to have your computer like um i don't know how the word is called hygiene it's really important to keep your stuff very clean if you want to work good okay so yeah at least i think that okay so, yeah guys, um, I don't know what to say while I'm cleaning this. Um, just make sure you also touch the aluminium parts in there because, yeah, you don't really get access to those either. But only if you press the key and then just go like this in circles maybe. Okay, and also this part. Be careful, don't be rough, okay. Also shut down button and, yeah, maybe this part. You don't want any water go in there because there are the fans. If I don't, if I'm not wrong, okay. So yeah, you don't want any water to go anywhere, basically. So I'm actually looking if. Okay, and basically that's all you have to do now. If you want to go over this with some water, then just go ahead and do so. Okay. You can hear the clicking right there. Alright. 
And um, yeah guys, I think that's basically it for the keyboard, so let's move on with the screen, okay? Alright guys, so we're going to continue with the screen, and this is basically the hardest part of this um, project, or whatever you want to call it, or this video, okay? So you're going to take your spray, and remember not to clean with any window product cleaning thing, okay? So you're going to take the soft thing, okay, whatever you took before for the water, and put it on top, alright? And start cleaning, okay? So it's gonna be a bit hard for uh, to put this on the camera. And don't worry, this doesn't harm your computer at all, okay? Doesn't matter. All right. If you want to actually be more careful, but like I said, it doesn't harm your computer. Just go ahead and do this like this, okay? Just put it there, okay? And and just go over it. All right. And while while you while you're cleaning, it might look like it's not doing anything, but you know afterwards it dries and then it looks perfect. Okay, so yeah, just go on on the sides. All right. All right, make sure you clean this as well, okay? Trying to do my best here. Alright, this is really easy guys, it doesn't take much time, like maybe 10 minutes the whole process, okay? So yeah, just go ahead and do some more if you want, put ahead, um, go ahead and put some more of these on top and just go do it again. But I think I'm going to let it dry first, okay? So yeah, I'm going to wipe this thing off because uh, this stuff is a bit hairy, it, it has some hairs on it and it leaves it on the screen. So yeah, try to get something that's not hairy, okay? So yeah, um, but it's looking pretty good. I don't know if you guys can see on the camera, but yeah, I'm gonna let it dry and I'll tell you guys in a few minutes, okay? All right guys, so I understand if you guys can't really tell the difference between the pictures and uh, how it was before, but really I guarantee you that it really turned out well with just some home stuff and some water and some um, cloth, okay? So yeah guys, thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, rate, don't forget to check out my giveaway, it's running right now and I guess we'll catch you guys in the next one right here on Magnology HD.